Hey, what's going on you guys? Drum Machine Addicts is back again with another highly requested tutorial. And today we are back in Ableton Live and we're going to show you how to manipulate audio. Now, when we say manipulate audio, we mean everything from how to merge clips, uh, how to throw effects on it, how to use it in sampler, that kind of thing. So without further ado, let's go ahead and begin. Now, I found a real cool clip that I like or a real cool audio sample, whatever you want to call it, right? All right, I think you guys like that too, right? Cool, so let me go ahead and drag and drop. Now, I could drag it right here where it says MIDI track, and the cool thing about Ableton is, even though this is a MIDI track, boom, I can just go ahead and put this right here. All righty. Now, I'm gonna show you some really simple Ableton tricks, right? First, I'm going to show you how to duplicate. All right. So we have this clip right here. And let's say I'm going to move this marker to make it four bars. Matter of fact, that's what I'll do first. I'll go ahead and shorten this, right? So I clicked Command X that shortened my loop. Now I'm going to right click, press loop. Now, that loop was a little bit longer than uh, four bars. That's why it sounds a little bit off. But let's say I like what I have so far, right? Let's say I want to duplicate that. If you have a Mac, all you have to do is press Command D, Command D, Command D, Command D, Command D. And I keep uh, pressing that. And now we have all these clips. Now, you have all these clips, right? Let's say from here, you want to merge them all into one piece of audio. All you have to do is select the whole section press command J boom now there are no more separated pieces of audio they're all one piece of audio all right so with that we just showed you how to duplicate samples and how to merge them into one clip from there you can really do what you want you can go back to your audio effects uh, go to the actual track And an interesting thing worth noting is, uh, mind you, this is an old uh, project app loaded up. This is actually an audio track. And you can tell because it's letting you drop audio effects here and stuff like that. And normally, if you try to drop an audio track on a MIDI track, it'll try to turn it into MIDI or something like that. But anyway, from there, let's do what you want. All right, so yeah, from there, you can just go ahead and put audio effects on it and stuff like that. Or if you want, you can go ahead and drop in a sampler, right? So you can go back to your Ableton Instruments, go to Sampler. All right, and I put it on the second MIDI track. So then it says drop, sound, drop sample here. Oops. Boom. So from there, I have it in sampler. So now I can do some real sound manipulation in it. Now, if I had a whole bunch of samples, if I was doing multi sampling, which is something we'll go over in another video, I could map out over 128 sounds across the MIDI keyboard. And then I could have each key play a different sample. Really crazy stuff. But we're not going to do that today. If I want, I can go over to the oscillators. I can activate an oscillator, start playing around. Moving peak, the sustain, release. Start playing with the type of wave. So yeah, I can do that. I can activate the sound envelope. I can start playing with those parameters too. So pretty much from here, you can really just do what you want. And then if you want, you could even throw it in a sampler or excuse me, a simpler. Uh, you could create another MIDI track. 
you drag a sampler over to it drop the sound in there and then from there if you want you could just chop this up into a sample you know what I mean and you don't have to do it by transient you could do it by region and then man you could have a ball and you could still go back and manipulate the sound even more by transposing it and this is using warping so yeah um, but those are the basics, man. That's pretty much all the stuff you can do with audio in Ableton, so you can get really creative. Um, but with that said, I think we are good for the day. Don't forget to check back in with us next week. Don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend. And we'll teach you some more about audio and warping in some later tutorials. Have any questions, hit us at drummachineaddicts at gmail.com. Peace.